What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today, so today I'm trying a uh, Discord Inspire deck with 3 Nut. This is the Midnight deck. The idea of this deck is you can play actually in two different ways. You can develop your Haunted Pumpkin, protect it with the Forget-Me-Nuts, or actually do it the other way around, Forget-Me-Nuts on one Pumpkin, and then you can also protect these cards, not only with the Little Buddies for free, but just with Garlic and the Walnut are going to be really, really good in terms of protecting these cards. You can also just develop Triceratops or Juggernaut on two, so you can really come in with a lot of tempo. There's also a way of just, like, holding off a little bit the first few turns, uh, maybe controlling them with your um, with your hot date, but coming in on turn four with a combo of three nut garlic. I'm probably gonna end up playing this deck much faster usually since I'm not really running another three. I think the original, um, pretty sure the original deck list had like some hammers in it, which maybe sort of is missing. I really took those out for the little buddies. So I think they're gonna be a great combo on turn three itself. Uh, with the three nut i think just playing these two cards uh usually and you know not necessarily the easiest card to take out on three beam if it does you'll still have a little buddy and you'll actually have gotten a shot out of it so uh for the finishers are going to be uh cob cannon and elderberry there's a lot of really great targets with all the walnuts and the little buddies uh for these cards Hello, or if just something gets in trouble and you just need some extra attack you can definitely go with the elderberry thank you starch lord for the lulus uh you can also even just play elderberry dry once you have played your three nut because then it's a four cost three four strike through which is really really good again you don't want to necessarily be playing pumpkin and cob cannon once you have a three nut on the field but it could be viable anyway hope you guys enjoy let's see how this deck does i also ran a couple of photosynthesizers in order to keep your early game alive i guess i'm sort of committing to the more tempo strat than really being able to control on turn three and set up on four since i'm running the little buddies and the and the photosynthesizers instead of cards maybe more like hammer i, I want to maybe keep an eye on that we'll see how that goes double triceratops is a keeper against the morticia i don't really want to spam this on one so let's see what we get garlic probably is the better card we get one of these two question is do i get rid of a juggernaut once i have so it's gonna be two three so I get rid of a Triceratops. This is too many twos now. Unfortunately, it is. And there's there's a curve, ladies and gentlemen. So we pass turn one. Bucket it. I won't play the garlic on one this this time, guys. Don't worry. I learned my lesson the hard way from the comment section and the UT. You're right. You don't you don't play some. And try to set up a greedy three nut on, on turn three. It's too greedy. Wait till turn four. Oh, gambles. Do you think this deck will go 8 into... Guys, sorry, I forgot about your gambling addiction. I'm sorry, I have to be an enabler here. So if you think this deck will go at least 8 into, then vote yes. And if you think it'll go 7 and 3 or, or less, vote no. This, of course, is not on YouTube. It's on the live Twitch stream, twitch.tv forward slash fry em up. Stream every day at about... Start at around 2, between 2 and 3 p.m. Eastern time. Look it up. This is going to be a teleportation zombie. How do we deal with this? Do we just pass, pass, pass against this guy? Uh, well, we could develop the Triceratops. This will be annoying enough. Do we do it here? I'm going to do it here. Ah! Play it! Oh, so <laughs> it did it. My, my app actually just glitched. It did not... I did click, and it did not play the card. Okay, we're going with the mid-range, guys. Shut up. This is another teleportation zombie? This is fine. It's a squirrel. It's a squirrel. Are you kidding me? Who is this guy? Who is this guy? Bro. Uh, Shut up and take my money. Trying again from yesterday. Z A H A H M B Z A H A H M B Z A H A H M B Y B Y B Y. Oh oh. Shut up. Question is, do I play a little buddy on heights to drag this?
the heck is this? Yeah, why not? It's a fine job. I'll hold off on this one. We have another three nine hand, so I don't have to get too, uh, too over the top here. That is fine. It's okay. We're doing really well here. Hammer would be really nice right now. Way better than this photosynthesizer. Come on, man. He's not going to really be able to break through here. I think this goes here. And this goes. Well, let's say it goes here. You know, I was running dog. There's a nibble. Slowed him down this turn for sure. Still got a 3 1 in that lane, man. Dog. Beam me up. Teleportation zombie goes down. We're in great shape. Look at this. Look at this Triceratops. We'll get another card here too, man. Dog. This guy's kind of screwed already. No, not Pumpkin! Lame. Do we want three nuts to die? I guess I should put this not on heights. Because of uh, alienness. What well, gets the, the, the photosynthesizer? I guess this will continue to, to keep working. Hopefully we'll get something playable here. Ah! It's so good! It's so good! <laughs> Give me a one drop! Give me one drop! Yes! Yes! Oh my gosh, the synergy is real! <laughs> that was so great. This goes to four? Click piece goes to four with three nut game mechanics. It like goes, it the the, the forget me nuts makes its base health three and it gets the buff on top of that. Get base attack. I mean that's so awesome. Wow, this is literally the best thing we could have got actually from that was a miracle. That was a miracle. This is one of the best things we got and this is the best thing we could have got. That's going highlight comp. I don't even care, man. Some three nut madness. Let's go. Crazy man. And we top deck another one. Are you and we can team these up too. This is guys, this is absolute utter insanity. Are you kidding me? This is gonna survive now. In fact, this will just protect the haunted pumpkin. Here, see ya. Enjoy your card. Probably better not to even play this because oh well, that's fine. Probably better just take the five damage here. Let this absorb the shock. <laughs> Chopper commando doesn't do a damn, not a damn thing. Give this man a see. He's regretting he played his squirrel. He was so happy on turn three, but little did he know. Shut up and take my money. No, you shut up and take my money. Wait. Thank you. Thank you, Ribsy. <laughs> I have to change that voice. It's so disturbing. I should change it to like the, the sexy girl voice. Here, one second. Where do I do this? If you guys want the old voice, you better donate real quick because I'm changing it. That stuff's going bye bye. Oh, look, mommy. It's a big, thick man. He's a thick man. No one cares, Johnny. It goes down to three. It's fine. Get that thick man out of here. <laughs> You didn't have any rocket science. I don't care. Okay, let's guarantee lethal. <gasps> oh no! The click feet. Look at the value, guys. Look at that. Look at the extinction event. Let's go. 
uh, is guaranteed lethal. <laughs> Go. He's going face. The man's going face. <laughs> Okay, that's all going in the highlight count. Say the date for YouTube. It's uh, June 10th, 2021. It's a beautiful day to be alive. What was I just going to do? I was going to change the voice of that. God damn. Okay. It's photosynthesizer. Well, it was so good there. We just had the best photosynthesizer of, of the year. Probably more removal is better because, again, one thing this deck does is put a lot of damage on but doesn't clear lanes. So, um... Controversially, even though I do think the photosynthesizer is a worthy, a worthy card, I'm gonna run. The deck really does need more removal, though. It really is actually lacking in that department, and we also need a turn three setup play. Should I just run four hammers? I think like this. <laughs> Chat's gonna be so mad at me. <laughs> one juggernaut. We're down to one, boys. We still have enough setups on two, I think. You're not always setting up on two. You don't have to play that way. Raybuster could be good. This would have actually answered the teleportation. This would have been better. <laughs> okay, let's go, guys. Alright, this is the new deck list. Open text to speech. Here it is. Voice. English. Auto. How do I... It doesn't have different voices? I, did, I switched to English Great Britain because their... Because their accent is objectively better than ours. Maybe the voice sounds better too. Why did they change the default voice? I can't switch which voice it is? Uh oh. Can super... Oh my gosh. This hand against super brains? Godlike. Let's go. Uh, yeah, that's right. Should have mulliganed something there, though, actually. I, I should have actually mulliganed something. I was spending too much time working on my on my voice that I, I didn't. I, I, we need like a walnut or a garlic in this hand just to be able to protect this. Uh, it's okay. It's still a great hand. <laughs> I can't. Shut up and take my money. In fact, if he passes here, Try the forget me nuts is stuff. fine. I just wish I had a second card as well. Wait, I didn't hear it. Oh, I didn't save the settings though. Open alert variations. Okay, so he's just ignoring me. There's that. See, I, I really, really would like to have had a um, like a walnut or a garlic. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? You should be so stupid. Uh, I guess I'll take the good trade here. My gosh. The three nut is very likely gonna be playable. Depends what he plays, but he's been spending his 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 brains here, so. Survey says. No. So it's forget me nuts now. Just here. I wonder if I just do this for a card, because I don't have anything to combo with this. This is so awkward. I'm doing it for a card. Okay, save the settings. We'll see. Okay, I saved the settings now. We'll see if this great Brit Britain voice, the Brit voice, is better. Give me a garlic. Jeez. Okay, so we always have this as an option. Is this good? I'm just not seeing the setup here, so I think I'm just covering this. It's 10 damage. 3 plus 2 actually works next turn. This is fine. We're in great shape. Pump 
fucking sucks. Mm. That's harsh. Uh, this probably will not. This will this will probably proc the block, and then this will probably proc, proc the block. So this is the play. Don't really have a setup for the cob cannon, unfortunately. Deadly. So annoying. So block, and the thing that would protect this. No, no. Okay, by three nut. It's fine. We don't really need that anymore. And we got heal, which is terrible. This is awful, guys. Come on, man. We needed Walnut there. And the other thing would have been Bubble would have also really been better. It just moved the Triceratops to one. So the worst power, okay. This does not work against... I have to keep that in mind. What the heck is this thing, man? Okay, I'm literally just... Well... It's probably just Cobb in one. He's down to four. Setting up multiple plays here would be nice. Maybe we use... It's like this. This is so awkward. It's like, okay, we play this for... Okay, this is smart. Now, I know, I know that... I know this doesn't have synergy with the three nut with the, against the cowboy. It doesn't, but the three attack does kill the cowboy. So this is the play. I mean, the explosion doesn't kill it, but this also sets up lethal for us. This should be fine. The hot date, the explosion does not kill it, but the three damage attack would. Bro, okay, it's still fine. He'll go after the 4-2. Okay, we're still getting him down to 1 here, usually. Still getting him down to 4 here, usually. We're still in good shape. This guy's on the ropes, for sure. <laughs> so annoying. That was actually a really, really good... <laughs> Wait, how did we kill this, also? How did, how did we kill the... Did they have, like, an alien ooze or something? What the heck is going on here? Oh, that's pretty damn good, actually. Uh. So that one never dies. So it's like this. It's like this. Here we go. Where did he get alien news from, though? Oh, he got it from Haunted Pumpkin. Duh. Gosh. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of, of cutting the pumpkins. I don't know, man. Frozen. Okay. Ugh. I think we're okay. 7 health. 11, actually. <sighs> Unfortunately, we're not able to clear the lane here. It sucks, man. Okay... I just, I'm considering not using the hot date. The problem is, is that he does seven, eight. We always, well, we always heal here, I think. The question is, how are we going to get four damage if I, if I ditch the hot date now? There's almost no way of getting damage in. Man, another cob cannon would have been really sweet. Really sweet. I think we have to just stay alive and hope for, like... Another removal card. We're not going to be able to use the hot date next turn anyway if this all stays alive. I wonder if the 3-1 is better. It probably is. There's also a chance of blocking the space time this way. Yeah, 3-1 is better. Oh, snap! <laughs> I thought I could think I'm getting it back. A little, a little wishful thinking there, man. Well, wow, if I would have passed, I would have gotten this back. <laughs> theory, theory. I'm happy to support you, Fry. Thank you. I've been watching for years and used your decks, videos to learn this game. My donation doesn't even cover what you've done for the PVZ Aww. community. You're so nice. Thank you so much. That was from uh, World Something, World Rums. I really appreciate it. 
You're so nice. Thank you for your twenty dollar donation and for your very, very kind words. It makes it it means a lot to me that my content means a lot to other people. Does that make sense? I don't know. Us winning here is an absolute long shot. He is protected! <laughs> Turns out if I would have passed, then, uh, you know, if I would have thought that was a pogo, then uh, there's no way of knowing it's a pogo there. I would have leaped the the surprise guard into a six drop. Why is he, why is he leaping the two drop? That's weird, man. I don't think there's anything in our, well, a cop cannon could actually win. Cop cannon in two could win. Yes, not of a removal card, not of a teleport. And us... If we get a Cobb Cannon here, this is the miracle of a century. Are you kidding me? Or an Elderberry Cobb? Bro! There's no way this is happening right now. Hey, I'm back. If we win this game, this is the one of the greatest miracles he got from a leap. Bad Moon Rising! Gadget! No! Ugh. The blocks! Are you kidding me? Going in the fail cup. I know about you. <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> that was one of the fails of the century now. Raw. We're one and one. Such BS, man. Such BS. What am I supposed to do about that, man? This deck's still good. We'll be fine. Where, where did the deck struggle? We need a leap. Let's just want to run a grave buster now. Thank you, Yao Wako. I feel like if I would have developed, he also got a really lucky, um, him getting that electrician early. If I really would have mulliganed early for maybe, uh, you know, walnut or garlic and running four of those, even a hot date or a little earlier would have helped, or a little buddy would have really, really helped. So I think me mulliganing better actually probably would have pushed us over there. But anyway, that guy, man. If we're developing someone, the garlic becomes extremely good on two. I think I'm just keeping this. We don't need a hard mulligan for three nut over here. If it weren't for the BS at the end, I would have won. Well, <laughs> that's even getting that regifter. <laughs> I don't know. Wow, thank you so much for voting for Fry Him Up by playing freaking Rooster on turn one. Why? Like, why? You should have played the Cobb in one, then Hot Date in two, so Walnut from the block wins. Oh, you're right. I could have put Cobb in one. Well, I wouldn't have hit the Doctor Spacetime that way. But was hitting the Doctor Spacetime good anyway? 
walnut from blocking. Uh, it wouldn't have actually made a difference given that what happened there, but maybe you're right. Perhaps. So there's two plays. There's just the oh, I could just bubble too, man. This bubble looks awfully good. I can also garlic just to add add damage and add protect preemptive protection. I think I'm bubbling this, man. I'm gonna use the garlic too. Plays around deadly and also it just adds adds free. It's bullseye. Look, the, the garlic is bullseye when it's with a another non bullseye minion essentially because it doesn't add block meter charge. I'm probably just playing hot day. We've all three of our hot days. I'm probably just playing hot day here. Okay, never mind. <laughs> um, it's actually better like this because uh, we want him to proc the block so the Tracheratops grows. Just in case he rolled one. <laughs> we actually got the smelling zombie. <laughs> the garlic is real. Well, I'll be keeping that. It's extra damage. Let's go. Okay, so that does. Uh, game mechanics. There's no way that we can pull something into lane two because the chicken. No. This happens first, and then the chicken. What the hell is this? Ow! <laughs> He's looking for toxic waste, and the man, the man is desperate. So do I just play this double here? Ooh, how do I play this? If I play this here, does it... S no. Oh, this will actually move if I play here. I have no idea how to play this. I don't actually have a play here. Is giving this to him? Maybe I just pass. I kind of have to kill these, though. I mean, I could get four regular instead of three bullseye, which kind of sucks, but in the long run, it's probably good. What if he has his... Does, he hasn't shown us a superpower yet, has he? I think I... Well... I think I just clear a lane. I don't know, man. I have to... He hasn't shown us a superpower. This is how we ducky. The deadly is good enough here anyway. Smoke bomb. What? You, you'll take the four damage just like a man. Look at this Chad. Look at this guy. <laughs> Oh, you're a tough guy. Oh, you're a tough guy, eh? Why is he not blocking? You're down to nine health. Now he's down to two. This is bullseye too, man. Okay, that was so cringe. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Boo! No one cares. Seriously. You know how many people care? So he's just over committing right now. Uh, is there a way to actually activate both of these garlics? We put one here. We suck this in. We can only play one? I don't see the I don't see how this works. We can only take one of these. I guess I'll take the take the this one. Oh, I should have played this. I should have played this because of his well no, he's not blocking. We're blocking. Well, super, I guess, is good. I still don't know what his superpower. Wait, no, it can't be. It's not, sorry, it's not superpower. I don't know what I'm saying. I just really spaced out. Has he not shown us a superpower yet? Probably playing this pumpkin was correct there. Because then it would have at least given us another guy in the field. Doesn't really matter. <laughs> Overthinking this. Way overthinking though. Ho ho ho! I'm trying to like outplay the guy who plays <laughs> by rooster into ghost and the ducky and smoke bombs to the water lane. Ho oh. <laughs> oh. <All right. laughs> Thank you so much. Oh. 
Lamb Moon. How come everyone's under rank 30 today? I don't know what's going on. Oh. 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 I think I'll just do this on three. Why not? Maybe I'll actually just keep... I, I potentially can play this on two. All right, let's go. Mm. It's actually even better now. So you play this. You play... Is there any reason to play this one on the ground? Laser Base Alpha is the reason not to. But he's not going to be able to do that until turn four anyway. I think he plays on the ground. Because then the Forget-Me-Not sort of protects this better sometimes. Against what, though? I I'm really overthinking this, guys. He dum dum bum boo I do have an editor, but for the daily videos, I edit them all myself. He only does the highlight comps. We need a leaf, guys. Wait, what I thought I escaped the basement. I could just save this. It's, it's going to be really good on turn four. Insanely good. He doesn't really have an answer to this. So for teleport Swabby. I'd rather also surprise him with. Like if he made a play there. Or if he could play beam me up. Which he can't. So I'm just passing. But it's not worth it for the one extra damage for a couple turns. This will end up doing a lot more if we wait. Okay. Let's see what's going for telepathy. We stalled that. We've gotten two brains worth of tempo out of this already. Right all. Great card. See, if he just goes after this, I wonder if I just set up the three nut right now. I think I do. The question is, where does the I since I have another three nut, I, I, maybe I don't even protect this one. This is weird. Well, him killing this is really inconsequential right now, right? He's passing for a, a trick again. I guess I'll do it like this. The block meter also likes this way better. If he just beam me ups here, he loses, so that's fine. Bum 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 ba da da. Ho ho ho! Three cost frozen mustache, let's go! Okay. Okay, bro. Another garlic. What do you know? <laughs> okay, guys, this three nuts pretty damn good. I ain't lying. Pretty damn good. <laughs> That's so broken, man. <laughs> Completely broken. Wait, so I guess this will go to three and then grow. I guess this does synergize with three nut. It should be the same as click P. That this will actually have six attack if you if you upgrade it. It's probably not worth it. It's so done, man. I just need a removal card. I don't even. Oh, there, oh, there it is. Ladies and gentlemen, got a removal card. La 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 ba. Ba da da da. Three and one now, right? You just listen to the song you're having. It's called "Good Days" by the Golden Grants. <laughs> the cereal. Uh, you just got vaccinated today and you feel ill. How did you feel? So I felt perfectly. People I know felt ill. Uh, I got Moderna first shot. I haven't gotten a second one yet. Uh, people I know who got the AstraZeneca, or whatever it's called, felt ill. I, it probably doesn't matter which one. It, it, it really just makes an autoimmune response, so you you can feel like you have a, you're fighting a fever for that day. I know a lot of people feel like they have a little flu after they get the vaccine, but... I felt fine. I felt great. <laughs> like it wasn't like oh a little under the weather. I was I couldn't feel a damn a damn thing. Okay, here we go. Is this super? Oh, this is so good. I'm actually gonna get rid of this for a little more tempo options because we have the garlic already. Oh my gosh, super brains cannot deal with this crap. <laughs> so I'm gonna go with the pumpkin first because it's super brains against almost any other hero. I guess HG. Uh, I would go with this. He's going to either go for a beam me up, which is the best case scenario, because then we double up here and he can't play it. Um, or he goes for a minion and garlic just protects us and set up the forgiveness. Nice. Nice having a spirit garlic in case we... Eh, he's going for beam me up. Watch him pass. <laughs> this just does a little more damage here. I'll probably end up protecting this too, because it's clearly getting value against past super brains. Wow! We rolled double three, so it turns out the garlic did... Uh... Damage. More damage here. 
Na, 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 na. Oh my gosh, she's going for beat me up again. <laughs> he's gonna do it again. I'm, I'm, I'm spilling my hands. No, he's not. Okay. Do I set this up though? There's really not a whole lot. I mean, okay, so it's setting up. Instead of doing two, it'll be down to nine. Instead, we'll hit him twice. It'll be down to seven with a pretty low block meter. I don't have a play for next turn. But at the end of the day, if we get a Elderberry, this is great. If we get a three nut, this sucks. I could go the half measure and not commit the garlic until he shows us. Until, using the garlic defensively will probably end up being better than one damage. So I'm actually just going to set the forget me nuts. And this will work. This will work regardless next turn. Okay. It feels like I'm cyberbullying right now. <laughs> it's just super brains and it can't deal with pumpkin. There's just no. It's so harsh, man. Oh my god. It's turn four right now. It feels like it, it should be at least turn seven. I thought it was Smelly Zombie too. It was Drone Engineer. I think the correct play for him right now is hit the concede button. No, 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 no. Okay, so this does not get exponentially better next turn, so. <laughs> Put a freaking mustache on you in here, though. <laughs> I feel so bad for him. Okay. None of his superpowers do a damn thing there. <laughs> oh, here's Trina. We finally got it, bro. Boys. I have three team ups also for the cop cannons. No need to. No need to pull pull back here. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh man, going face, man, going. He's conceding in style. Here, we'll heal, heal our garlic. It's very nice. That's how you can see. You can see it like a Chad. Um. Na 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 na. We're three and one now, right? Or am I? Or am I? Oh no, now I'm four and one. Yeah, now I'm four. Oh my god. I need to get a new chair. This thing, this chair, I don't know if you noticed during the stream, I just like sink. This chair sucks. Daisy girl? Uh oh. Ding dum ba da 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 da. That's a pretty good hand. I think we need to spam the garlic here. Um, just so we have an option against the turn two. Um, some people are not going to like this, but if he just plays Swashbuckle the next turn, he kind of like wins. So I'm actually probably just going to spam these in front of the Gravestone right now. So. Space time. <clears throat> I should probably still do it. <sighs> I, I always play the walnut, so let's just play this and see what we got. No, it does damage here. I guess this takes us out over the course of a few turns, but also while well, the laser sucks. So I play around laser. I actually have this next turn now. Into Elder. So maybe to play around the laser base alpha, I'll just do this. We're in a pretty good spot here. And we have the little body. I love the little the little body let, lets us actually play the three nut. Which is amazing. And we have plenty of places for this elder break the next turn. Main Toxic, so we need a hot date now. So Trapper Territory, I think Freenut. 
Well, I guess I should just go double face here. It's probably better. Yeah, we go... Well, yeah. Well, I think this is right. We don't... Because of how we've been playing, we don't have enough setup anyway. The three and I can get hit one extra thing here, so he has Trapper. We not actually lose, though, which is nice. I could just play Elderberry here now. Elderberry, I guess, would get the buff from the three nut, right? That's it. Wait, I know abilities. Well, Admiral Navy Bean sees. Listen, Admiral Navy Bean sees the bean being played. So why would three not not see the elderberry being played? I think this is gonna go to six. Think so? What is this gonna be a pogo anyway? It's probably still worth it because this dies for free here. We have no three in hand. I think this game mechanics, you guys should know this, right? We could also go here. Is it more value? Uh, Dr. Space Time's not really doing anything, but this one's also wilting, so maybe... Alright, let's go. It's also better against Pogo. It does, it does see it. Oh. Okay. Charging my block meter essentially, we're doing six here. And we're rolling ones. Like a boss. So it's six, because the three nut makes it have a base attack of three, and then it gains three attack on top of that. So instead of going to five, it goes to six. Actually synergetic with three nut. Pretty damn cool. Don't drop that stuff. Oh my gosh, we can't even play this now. Talk about bra moments. We actually want the three nut to die here because we're playing Cobb Cannon next turn. So I'm actually gonna do it like this. That's a good plan. Kind of mess this up and perhaps it's tricks next turn. What do I get here? Oh, come on, Walnut! Oh, it's all Bullseye, never mind. Not blocking. I'm blocking anytime soon. Okay, we're in okay shape here. This is a really, this is an incredible heal because it keeps these alive for the Cobb Cannon, which is real nice. Should have a really high valued uh, Cobb Cannon here. There also is another play. It's weird he has Toxic Waste in, but hasn't really shown us another imp since then. Na, 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 na. I don't even see the cop cannon right now. I think we'll have a better one later. So I'm doing this. I'll feed him a card. We'll probably get a better cop cannon next turn. Just profits blocker. Who rolled a one? Clones. Clones die for free. Ooh, I don't like those clones. Uh, one of them will. In fact, we might just do a dry cob. We'll see how this works. In fact, it makes him not able to play a minion here. It's really weird. Awkward indeed. Okay. What are you bouncing? A one drop. The man is weird. How exactly do we do this? A zombie evolution. So this dies for free. It's just this and, and Cobb Cannon and we kill the Disco. There's no way to be extra creative here. Oh, it's like this. Oh, it's like this. Okay. 
That's... That way, even if he has fruitcake, which costs three, uh, we still win. Yeah, he can't answer all these things. Man down! Man... <laughs> Overthinking this so much. <laughs> he can't answer two minions, let alone three, when we have a forget-me-nuts in the field. We're making the efficient play, guys. What could it possibly have saved in there? No, nothing. <laughs> What? Okay. This looks awfully good. Uh, it's gonna be another brainy hero that I regret mulliganing hammer against. I really want a, 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 you know, getting a... He doesn't really have an answer. This is so good. I wonder if I just get rid of Triceratops here. Because it just dies to rolling stone. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Come on, garlic. It's still better. I'm gonna keep the hammer now, too. So, we spam this on one, since the worst he can do is, like, nerf. Nerf this. And he does that, too, anyway. Okay, you're garbage. Forget me nuts lives? Oh my gosh, look at the little buddy value. It's so good. Especially against a teacher deck. This is, like, MVP. Let's go. Oh man, little buddy. Best card in the game. It seriously is. <laughs> it's an S tier card. It's so great. Oh! Let's go! Okay. This is nice though. That's nice. He'll probably go. No, he can't beat me up. He's gonna Rolling Stone that? It's not good. What is he running with Teatron 1? He's either misplaying Pagarati or going like Trick Ball. <laughs> It's too much. It was too much. So I to pumpkin quit. That was a great play. Definitely counting that as a win. <laughs> Man down. Man down. Let's go. I like this deck. I should use this in the tournament, guys. I don't know, man. It would take a lot of balls for me to use a, a three nut deck in a tournament. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I did ban Z Mac though. I should go for it. Um, okay. Okay. So this is good. I'm just gonna get rid of the date. Oh my gosh, it's happening again. Do we get rid of the garlic now? Okay, this is still a great hand because we can protect both of these. These are definitely useful. <laughs> we don't have the answer to teacher. Oh, yeah, we do. We just play this. Okay, so it's definitely Haunted Pumpkin. Uh, what lane would this go in? La 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 la. <laughs> he actually committed a one drop, too. This guy's so dumb. <laughs> I think he's done already. GG. So Gravestone here, we'll go Garlic for get me nuts. He actually kills the teleportation zombie. Teachwar! Commit another card. This is the same guy? Oh my gosh, he got a 4-3. That's so good. Dear God. Okay, so we don't want to bubble here. We want to play Garlic. We want to play Forget Me Nuts instead of the um. I'm just looking at the block meter. I think the pumpkin wants to go here. So this is a great play, actually. See, now... No, Rolling Stone. Uh, no. You can't play Rolling Stone. You can't play... What was he playing? I'm playing. Just teleport. Great. Perfect. I think I just go face. I think our 4-2 our hitting face is better than his 4-3. Little buddy. Nice. It's probably gonna, I don't know what his man's gonna do. <laughs> I feel so... I can't believe you got a flame face, though. It's Bolshevik. Na 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 da dum boom boom da 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 dum. Come on, man. 
It's not that hard. Yes, it is. It's very hard. <laughs> we have seven damage on his face, and it's about to get a lot loud. Frostbolt can't deal with Forget Me Nuts and Hunt Pumpkin. It's just not. It's just you just just concede. I'm counting this as a win. It's going to be another case of the Rust Bolt curse. It's just hard to control with him, man. You don't even have like the 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 the, the yeah, anyway. Even like a couple barrels of where brainstorm would have helped here, but it's no answer. Okay, so we're seven and one. We need one more game for the bets to initiate. Let's go. Mm -mm -mm. That absolutely counts. We were dominating him. We were dominating him on turn three. We were in. He was in an almost unwinnable position. Extremely sad. Couldn't even rocket one of the pump kings because of forget me nuts, which is not a good play. You don't want to be spending three cost cards on one. It's not good. Another Ross Ball. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. So you got a hard mulligan for the pump kings and the forget me nuts again. You're useless. You're useless. I don't want to play slow. I want to play fast. Would I dare get rid of this against Ross Ball? I want Cobb Cannon. I don't think this is going to do anything anyway. Okay. Aha! We got Forget Me Nuts. There's still hope. Oh my gosh. Forget Me Nuts on one bubble on two is just going to be fine. Oh, yeah. We're fine. We're fine here, guys. Plus, we have a great turn four play. Right, I just said four play. La 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 la. Bring me all of your rust balls. <laughs> I wonder if I should count this as a win if he just concedes here. We're so far ahead already just for playing this deck in a rust ball. Okay, here we go. Now if he concedes, I legit will count it. Yes, okay, here we go. Forget me nuts initiated. <laughs> Probably just gets rolling stoned anyway. Beam me up's unplayable, yeah, it's Rolling Stone or Buff, so. There's no amount of bubbles that will save us. Oh, he didn't have an answer. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Having two three nuts is kind of sad. Ooh, having garlic and walnut here is. What the hell is that? Teleportation zombie? I don't really need to set this up yet. Maybe I should just bubble here, because he's passing the first couple of turns. What else would this be? Teleportation goes here. What is this thing? Gentleman? Teleportation zombie. Electrician goes here. Drone engineer goes here. Sumo. Sumo. Top deck sumo. Or gentleman zombie. And he has a whole elaborate plan on how he's going to actually do something with that. Landscaper. Why did he still- why did he not take it out for free, though? I'm so very confused. Because we actually have a 3 note, we can let this one die, so I'm probably just gonna spam the Walnut here now. Have this around for a while. <laughs> this is pretty good against the Landscaper deck, not gonna lie. So this is gonna go on Heights, and the Walnut's just gonna go here. This Elderberry ain't a bad play, either. We'll do it next turn. I don't know, that landscaper didn't make any sense, so I'm, I'm overthinking again. I don't know, I have no idea what you are, and I, I, I don't care. I do not care. See ya. <laughs> it's chemist! Landscaper chemist, guys! Look at this curve, look at the, this guy's, this guy's really going for it now. La, 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 la. I'm probably just gonna cover the forget me nuts with my with my burr. If he plays a gadget scientist, we have a three nut combo. That's nice. Mustache. I mustache you a question. I guess the forget me nuts is good here though. I should cover the um I should cover the three nut. Must it's a mustache deck? Why do you have chemists though? So very confused. Don't understand. I don't think I'm covering my forget me nut. 
I could actually just set up a second three nut here. It's not bad. I kind of like want. Do I want this three nut to die? Maybe I actually want the three nut to die. Because we just are cob canning next turn. Should I put three nut in front? That's crazy, man. We'll probably have a combo, yeah. We're almost always going to have a combo with Elderberry. We don't actually have to cob can them here. It's nice to have the option, but I think it's just going to be like. Three nut. Garlic. Which one of these do we take out? I guess we don't need this other three nut to live, so let's take out this car, this card draw card. Also gives us another option of where to put the cob cannon, which probably will be better. Okay. It's good to keep the free nuts in the field. He has a chemist. He's gonna. It's gonna get a lot of value. We're basically just trying to make him run out of steam right now. And the cob cannon looks really, really good with the um. Even just dry. If he plays gravestones here, I'm just gonna play cob cannon dry in one. Dry him up. Third three nut. Okay, it doesn't work anymore. Wow, that was lame. Uh, I don't know if the Cob Cannon... I mean, we could play Dry Cob Cannon. It sort of saves those two... The two guys here. Guess it's alright. I can also just play Elderberry. I think it's... Well, I don't like it, though. But it does keep two, three, ones alive. Probably worth it. Putting this here though. Alright, let's go. Lame. <laughs> oh, okay, the Cobb Cannon didn't do a damn thing. Thank you, Cobb Cannon. Actually, it made that this guy dies, because this would have actually broken through here with four health. And it would have had three attack too. This thing would have this thing would have busted us. Great cop cannon, actually. So he rolls a three. Is it 19 now? Nine, four. We're only making Can I please have a cheap card? Thank you. God. The only lane this goes in is here. He's passing on turn 8. Gosh, I have no idea what's going on. <sighs> Should I just go face now and let him have his tricks? I feel like his tricks become so much less efficient that I don't even want to cover it. It's a 6. Do I just spam the Tricarat? Maybe I just don't even play the Tricarat Tabs. Okay, I think I'm just doing this. Alright, that looks good. Some bandits with Mustache Waxer? It's not a bad idea, actually. Wow, I have to try that. I, didn't, if I wanted to do a flag, I didn't realize the mustache waxer could work, and this guy also. I should try it. Did he just clear my field? Jeez. Did he just weed spray? How did he. Are we rolling stone? I'm so confused. Okay, so now we have. Now we got some stuff going on. Problem is, he's just gonna outspam us, and this thing's growing so much. We have 3 2 2. What do we sag here? Do we just go for the bullseye and just give up on this? This is so good with everything that comes after it, but he'll probably be able to remove it anyway. Uh, I mean, there's. Ah, uh, man. Alright, it's probably just like this. We can't block this anyway, right? So there's no point in spamming it. Where does this go? Oh, yeah. Yes. So, uh, I don't think we're going to win this. I don't got a good feeling about this one, boys. He's just spamming. He's just minion spam. We need more removal. Urgh. It's the problem with 3-nut dice. You get all these things 
but none of them hit face, and the ones that do, they just remove. Okay. Look at the- he rolled a 1 also. Gosh. Oh my gosh. So I need to roll a 3 now. Just to make it even. There's no point in doing that. Rocket, you're just out of You're just outcarded, outvalued out everything here. Weed! Uh, so now we need like block. Anyway, all right, we're seven and two, guys. <laughs> I threw that game on purpose just for the the tension bet, guys. This is the game ten. It's all come down to this. Let's go, let's go, guys. Will we go eight and two, or will we fail miserably and only go seven and three? So much is on the line. How many channel points are on the line here, guys? I gotta play this up as much as I can. Um. 77% of you voted yes. Not looking so 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 fancy anymore. There's 30... What was this? 291,000 channel points. Fries have been voted for yes and 87,000 have been voted for no. Who knows what's gonna... It's another Rust Bowl! See, last time, the reason we lost that game... Very simple, actually. It's because we didn't have enough... Um, uh, I think I have to keep up. It's because we didn't have enough haunted pumpkins. That was the whole problem. No, bad, bad boy. We don't have to forget me now. So the Ugh, no. I'm scared. Probably should have put this here, actually. And he has nerf in his starting hand. Oh, okay. I'm happy I kept this 3 on <laughs> three none now. Not lying. Mm -hmm. Every top deck. This is gonna kill us. This is the problem here. You get two of that. You have to run four, and then you get two, and... Big stink. I don't even think I play this and to pass on two. I'm gonna save it for the three nuts. Oh, sucks. Oh, that sucks. Probably passing three also. Unless he commits something. Maybe I'll just spam a three nut right now. Do I need another one on five? I guess I do. Okay, so it's four, five. Lame. He's probably running Flick anyway. Thank you for charging the block meter, though. I really appreciate that, Pumpkin. Ooh! Look what I found! It's good, actually. Now we'll get a double set up here. What a hammer, man. No, this was correct. He could have controlled whatever we did with the teacher on the field. Now we can actually set up a play that he's unable to control. Probably even spread this into different lanes and stuff. What the hell, dude? Bruh. So I'm just gonna play around Flick. I'll play into everything else. We have a second uh, three nut. Garlic. We'll probably be able to control this, so then this procs a block and this hits. Also block me. We're we're in very decent shape. If he doesn't buff this, it dies free to Cobb Cannon too. We'll see if he teleports a paparazzi and does some things here. Played around the, the knockout. That was my number one. This guy's gonna beat me. It's not gonna be with knockout. Million IQ not in play. Whatever. I'm just saying I'm smart. It's fine. Don't say that, Fry. We made the right choice. La 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 Wow. Didn't have, doesn't have a second knockout. We know that for sure. Unless he's making me play into it here. So the options are Cobb. We'd probably just save the Cobb for like the paparazzi that's gonna come. 
I think we just spam her. Oh my life. Oh. Na 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 na. He probably does have a rocket somewhere though, so maybe not not putting this. I can just go with these. I don't. I think we have to keep. We'll we'll be able to get more. Later. He doesn't have another flick. I'm not gonna actually play into rocket here. But in fact, I'll play around it. Heal will be better next turn. Since he didn't have a second flick last turn, he probably can't even answer lane one. It doesn't do a damn thing. This is definitely Pagarazzi, but he's waiting for something. Maybe he just doesn't have a paparazzi. <sighs> he's down two teachers now, too, which sucks. He could actually tap like a flick. Oh, he protects his face. Instead of protecting his teacher. I kind of like that, actually. I wonder why. And the one damage procs the block. Pumpkin not being a completely useless piece of garbage on the field. He's definitely holding a rocket in his hand, so I'm just, like, very reluctant to, uh... I guess I will play it, though, here. Just to make it come out of him. And it costs three. I'd rather I'd rather it take three out of seven than two out of six, you know? What's the song called? It's the Golden Grams commercial song. It's called, like, Wonderful Days or something like that. He's probably just brick brick bolted. I think we played this correctly by spamming the pumpkin on one and waiting the next, waiting till turn four to, to make him. We waited till four or five. We waited till five. Wow, there's a trickster. <laughs> um, how do we play this? So this looks awfully good to take out the trickster. It also opens up the bullseye. Oh, yeah, this is the play. Here's the play. So it's six damage on the trickster. And we'll give him one of these. There's, is there a reason? I'm just trying to think of some kind of, like, trickster situation that we would need to heal here. We're probably not going to get our minions damaged too much, so I think I'm going to spam it just in case he has something. Like, going viral into Mustache Trickster would win. That would be a scenario. I think now it doesn't. Seven, six, and six. Uh, no, seven and six. That's not it's bonus attack. Okay. He's down to two. That's good. Nice that this lived, too. He, he used a rocket there, right? Maybe I should have not played into Rocket. I should have just played the Elderberry Dry somehow. I didn't even consider that. It's called Happy Together. Thank you, Akka Master. Think it's like this? I mean, he would need a second rocket, but... He's, he's way more likely for him to have two rockets than to have two... We can make a double play anyway. No, that was definitely correct. No, he's in for cards, but only has two brains left. He's done. He's done, we got him. <laughs> Tense game against... Against Trickster Razzi. That's what that was. Or maybe it was just... We didn't see a paparazzi. Maybe it was just Control Rustful with Teacher. Regardless, we got the 8 and 2. Let's go, boys. Pretty sweet deck. Pretty sweet deck. Um, I'm just sort of cranking, cranking, and seeing if, like, if the... I feel like we maybe have to commit a little more to going faster to going slow. Like, I cut some of the 2 drops. I almost feel like the elderberries were not good enough, so maybe cutting the elderberries for more... 
just like walnuts and juggernauts or something like that. We also kept getting screwed with getting several three nuts in hand, which I don't know how to solve that problem. Maybe only running three three nuts is correct. I don't know. Anyway, guys, the answer to the vote, the answer to their vote, is yes. We won eight, eight out of eight out of ten. Hope you guys enjoyed. That was the midnight deck. Uh, definitely an educational experience here. Peace. This is Fry.